This is burning weather. Um, we got cold and dry temperatures. Um, wet conditions uh, with an uh, overall temperature. DJF, Japanese. Japanese model uh, forecast. Uh, cold and east. Um, and cold and dry to the north. Um, get El Nino in place. Um, got everything on the side for um, this winter. And you got um, warm wheat cold PDO versus warm cold and warm waters. And you got the warm central El Nino conditions, Pacific El Nino conditions. And the um, Pacific. Um, you got the um, tripod, you got warm AM, AM, AMO tripod for cold in the east, most of the United States. And throw and dry conditions, um, cold in the east, um, cold and snowy in the east. This been updated October 1st, doing at 6.30 Eastern. Um, I want a video um, update. Um, I do, um, think this analog, um, is okay for the winter, but think more this winter will be like 2002-2003 winter outlook. And, here's the storm tracks I think it's going to take overall for the winter. It's going to take, um, the pressure going to take in the golf, go develop in the golf, go out the east coast, and... Sometimes they can go out to sea and the other pressures in Georgia and you know, grab the coast the you know, main and got the the cup assistance sky brother Canada gonna come out and bring storms down in the northeast. And you got a uh, few Great Lake colors for the winter. Like one of them. Great Lake colors gonna uh cut up the Great Lakes. Um this is my storm track for 2012-2013 winter outlook. Um I think um, the truck gonna dig in something similar to this pattern, um, and the pressure gonna build in the golf, and the two branches gonna face together, and that's gonna bring a snowy winter in the eastern part of the country than the west. Um, but the west gonna get in the good actions. The first half, second half, we gonna get in the good actions in the eastern part of the country. Um, so I think that storm in November, um, snowstorm in November, it's possible to have a storm with a tropical, um, grab the cold air and the um, tropical uh, in nature. Um, we got to see how that storm goes the next two weeks. Um, here's my um, the trough, I think, the um, pattern is going to shape out. Cold storm from the Great Lakes to the main and a little bit of the... Um, a thin layer of ice soon so set up, but not a big layer like past years. Um, but the thing is going to um, be like the face, the other going to face near the North Carolina. This is what I assume a little thin layer of ice going to be at uh, to Georgia to here. And they're going to end up phasing somewhere in here. They're going to phase. So, you can you can bet it's gonna be a ice zone, a little bit of ice zone through here. I'm gonna show you on. Uh, I'm about to draw a little something. I'm at, I'm gonna show you what I'm talking about. You gonna you gonna bet it's gonna be a little ice zone. I still think it's gonna be a little ice zone, but it's on through here, all through here. Um, the ice zone with the um two that face the other little ice, little thin layer of ice zone through this area here. And I do think the snow is going to be, pairs that want to face together are going to bring snow all the way up to uh, Maine, through um, here, heavy snow, through these areas right here. And I do think that um, the Great Lakes are going to see um, their um, lake effect snow, so I'll give this area blue. They're like if that snow gun band set up right here. Um and the trough um ridge is gonna be here. Like this.
So the storm's gonna take a track over the ridge, like that. Um, most of the time, it's gonna do that. Um, this is my update. Uh, when I update, I think it's good. Um, the cold and snow is gonna be through parts of North Carolina, Virginia, up the main, and Great Lakes can get there. Um, Lake FX snows and the ridge out west and I think that um it could be wet down here, rain down this area at times through this area down here. Rain, a lot of rain. Well um uh, flakes in Florida, northern Florida can get flakes of snow at times. Please comment, subscribe my video below if you got questions. Um with new gems that model. Bye guys.